The NBA on 2K Sports. It's a beautiful Sunday afternoon. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. David Aldridge is on our sideline. DA, it's all yours. Well, thanks very much, guys. Of course, the NBA has had some legendary trash talkers. But Damian Lillard says it's not really a verbal assault like it used to be. In this era, it's more gestures. From the watch your head to the too small or rock the baby to Trey Young's theatrical bows, players have their ways of sending a message. Devin? And the message usually received, D.A., <laughs> thank you. The starters for the Portland Trailblazers. Nurkic the pivot with Grant at the other post spot. Peyton is out there with Damian Lillard. And it's Winslow in at the three spot. And for the Lakers. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Russell Westbrook out there with Patrick Beverly. And it's Walker in at the three. GA, something that's kept Portland from getting over the hump is their defense. Kevin, their defensive rating hasn't been pretty for several years. It's a point of emphasis for the Blazers going forward. Shore up the D and try and take that next step. It'll be Los Angeles off the tip. And here's Beverly. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. Like how Beverly takes on challenges. This guy's a pit bull in his competitiveness. Aggressive at shooting over the defense, even when they're all in it. Now, here's Lillard on the wing, Winslow. Great tee that time from Davis. And it's Davis with the ball for Los Angeles. Beverly feeling it out a bit. Shot clock at five. Fires from the line. And he overshot that one, missing. On the wing, Winslow. He's covered by Westbrook. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It's still early in the season, and teams are still trying to figure out rotations. Greg, what's it like to play in a game like that tonight? Well, for a lot of these guys, Kevin, it's all about jockeying for a position, making an argument for minutes. And you want to earn the trust of your coaches. down the first one. Oh. 
both good from the line that time. One of my favorite eras in NBA history, Clark, the 80s Showtime Lakers. Man, I played against those guys. Thankfully, it was just twice a year that we were in the Eastern Conference. But those dudes were unbelievable. Magic running the point. Kareem still playing at a high level down low. Worthy finding his stride and finishing the break. They didn't just win titles. Showtime had a flavor that was fun to watch if you weren't being run out of the building by it. It's tipped. For Los Angeles, they've gone two or three here to start off the game. Davis kicks to Beverly. Loads it up for Davis. And out of bounds as the Trailblazers gain possession. And that's just carelessness there. I mean, you have got to have your head in the game. And here are the Trailblazers now. Grant the pass to Winslow. And the rejection by James. Great anticipation that time from LeBron. He sees the shot forming and gets there to swat it down. And that rejection had some mustard on it. Huge, huge play. Boy, I like the fact that's intimidation right away. Got to show those shooters. You're going to be in their face all night long. Just about two minutes into the game. First quarter of basketball. And that one's good. Lillard. Lillard's gone 50% from the arc. One of two. Outside, Walker. Back to Beverly. Loose, clock at four, and the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touch by Peyton. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. And relief for three. Head shot off. Now the Trailblazers take it the other way. Last game matchup with the Suns, a, a tough loss there. Scoring efficiency was an issue in that one. Took them too many shots to get their points. Yeah, and I think they just seem to be a page behind. A step slower out there all game. Now here's Walker. After the miss from Damian Lillard. Westbrook wide open. He fires. And the Lakers with another miss. And here's Lillard. He brings it up for the Trailblazers. Comes up empty down low. The shooting numbers just aren't there yet in the quarter. Here's LeBron. Rebound by Nurkic. Portland is gone. One or two from long range in the first quarter. Here's Winslow. It's good. He scores. That's his first basket after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. The yeah, heads up aggressive play right there. Saw the smaller man on him and took it straight to the basket. And that outstanding drive and finish brought to you by Mobile One. And you've got to love the aggression that he had taking it to the rim there. Sets the tone in a close game like this one. So timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. Greg, you take a look at Nurkic. He is at his best going against big-name centers. Nurkic is the kind of player who rises to a challenge, can be a bit inconsistent in what he gives you, but he loves the challenge of going up against the best. On defense, the Trailblazers. Davis finds Walker. Westbrook passes to Davis. Back to Westbrook. And the dunk by Westbrook. Really good court awareness that time from Anthony Davis. Seeing the floor and making the right decision. Lillard against Westbrook. Lillard, the pass to Nurkic. And here is Peyton. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And you look at the young talent the Blazers have. A nice, young, core group that can grow. Simon's the big name from that crew. The Trailblazers have had two chances at the line already, making them both. And if we want to take a look back, they converted about 76% from the line. 
And that just has to improve, guys. I mean, the free throw shooting is something that has to get better. You're immediately putting yourself at a disadvantage when you shoot that poorly from the line. The first one falls, and Simons and Little Greg, a pair of names Portland fans are definitely excited about. And, and they've shown that they can be valuable players. Uh, Portland got a lot younger with the trades they made last year. Now they have to have that youth develop. He's perfect from the line this time. You know, you think of the Lakers leading up to LeBron James joining them. This was a team that struggled for relevancy. And even during Kobe Bryant's final seasons there, they still were a little below par for the Lakers. And here's Westbrook from the arc. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. Boy, and that's a big deal for Westbrook because when he starts to knock down shots from distance, it really opens up his full bag of attack mode offense. Mark, as you recall, the Lakers had missed the playoffs the last few years leading up to LeBron James actually joining them. And you know what, Kevin? They missed it in year one of the King in L.A. as well. Some of that due to injury, but nonetheless, not part of the playoffs. Despite the bubble title, it's been a challenge for LeBron during his time with the Lakers. Last year, extremely frustrating. And I'm sure they want this season to be different. Lock at six. Grant kicks to Lillard. Here's Nurkic. Good. Great play by Lillard to set it up. You know, this is why you run the offense through Damian Lillard. I mean, sure, he's going to get his, but he's also going to make sure others get theirs, too. Here's Westbrook. He's got five. Outside, Walker. Westbrook finds Davis. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. That's tipped. LeBron James on the wing. With the shot. And there's another one for the Lakers. Love the unselfishness of Beverly. I mean, when he sees his teammate wide open, he quickly gets him the ball. Left side, Grant. Back to Lillard. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. Lillard's got five. Yeah, that's just good basketball there by Grant. Moving the ball to the wide open man and getting an assist out of it. The Lakers have gone 6 of 10 from the field in this ballgame. Outside Westbrook. It's Beverly on the wing. And it's Gary Payton the second with the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Then his shooters checked in for Patrick Beverly. On defense, the Trailblazers. They double team Walker outside Westbrook. James in the post. Working on Norkic. LeBron kicks it over to Schroeder. The kick out to Westbrook. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. And it's Davis missing. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that. And Davis sends it back. Davis so good with his timing and length to get up and deny shots. Feeds it to Grant. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. And Schroeder's got the ball here for the Lakers. The kick out to Walker. There's the three. They get it back. Here's Davis. Goes up again. And he lays it up and in. Davis has got his second basket. You know, it's not only his size and strength and athleticism, but Davis's timing is so special. That's why he boards it so well. And the first time out of the game called here for the Trailblazers. And looking at Anthony Davis, a huge part of this team. Sure is. I mean, along with every team he's been on, this is a superstar player. I mean, no question about that. He can headline a roster full of superstars. Not much on the floor, 
that AD can't do. And some changes here for the Lakers. Thomas Bryant comes in for Lonnie Walker. And it's Kendrick Nunn in for Russell Westbrook. An almost entirely new group here for Portland. Eubanks, he's checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. Nasir Little comes in for Winslow. Josh Hart, he's checked in for Gary Payton. And it's Simons in for Lillard. And they pick up two. No idea what they were thinking there defensively. I mean, that's a shot he makes often. Pass to none. Bryant with it. Trying to get open is Davis. The shot by Bryant, no good. And guys, not sure where his head was on that shot. Not what this offense was designed to create. Not at all. I mean, that's where they want him looking for a teammate, not trying to do it on his own. He needs to share the wealth there. And we see Portland revamping on the fly. A lot of changes. But it's not a rebuild. With this new look roster hoping to keep the Blazers relevant while also giving them a greater upside long term. Free throw is good, now leading by one. And this Lakers squad has a ton of talent, but some guys are well past their prime. Good on both. And what do you think GA is the next step for this Lakers team? Coming off a championship not that long ago, young firepower is surely needed. These older guys can't carry a team like they used to. Now here's Bryant. He had 15 points last out. Whistle blows. Yep, that's going to be a travel. And they're losing their concentration here, guys. Just sloppy with the ball. Portland leading. Now Simons. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Passes it to Little. Here's Grant. Bryant defending. Shoots a fader. No good from Grant. Putting up a goose egg bagel this period. At this point, you have to run the offense through somebody else. I mean, that's your only choice. Hard again, Schroeder. Five to shoot. The 15-footer doesn't go for him. Now Portland takes it the other way. They've been beating them to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here to start. Yeah, the half-and-half half balls are going their way, and that's really a function of effort and intensity. You know, the ball doesn't discriminate. Whoever goes and gets it, that's who owns it. And Davis can't get it to go. Portland's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Little. He can't get that one. Great D that time from LeBron. And pushing it up. Here's Los Angeles. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. Right here's a classic NBA question. Who's been the best franchise in league history? Celtics or the Lakers? Come on, Kevin. You are putting me on the spot but uh, I'd go with the Lakers more superstars over the years and I think that 2000s run with Kobe and company that put them ahead in my estimation shooting two And the first one drops. The Lakers making a switch here.
And so Nunn nails both of them. Just solid. Really one of the very best there is at the free throw line. Simons surveying the D. Just a little. From outside the arc. The offensive rebound. Grant. And the dunk by Grant. Well, I tell you, I think Grant's athleticism was what allowed him to win out there. Here's Schroeder. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Reeves the pass to Schroeder. And Grant sends it back. Well, he's an incredible athlete. You can just see that using his vertical and his reach on the defensive end. Outstanding block. It's stolen by Jones. It's Schroeder with the drive. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Grant's got rebound number five here tonight. Hard against Schroeder. 14 feet away. Bank shot. No good. And there's the foul. It'll go on Josh Hart. That'll be his second foul of the game. Sharp checked in for the Trailblazers. The Lakers trail. Schroeder outside. Outside Bryant. None looking around. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Trailblazers. Uh, they didn't hesitate to start working the offensive glass. And I tell you, those efforts have been rewarded with these second-chance points. You know, another point I'd like Shooting to add two. is that They've had tremendous success early on converting turnovers and turning those into points. And he knocks down the first one. It's also good, so he hits both free throws. 119 left in the first. Now, here's Hart. 11 points for him in that last game against Phoenix. He kicks it to Little. This one for three. Drills it from outside. Little's got five now. Boy, Hart is one of those guys you look at and you can just see the team is first with him. Never hesitates to find the open guy. 59 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Schroeder passes to Nunn. Schroeder dishes to Bryant. Six on the shot clock. Takes it out to Schroeder. No one near him. Rebound by the Trailblazers. And this is the first season matchup for them against the Lakers team. Yeah, and they lost the season series to this squad last time around. Maybe a little extra motivation tonight to show they've improved. Yeah, I couldn't agree with you more. Two teams in the bottom half of the conference as far as respect goes. They're both scratching and clawing to try to get a little more of that respect. And here is Los Angeles now after the Trailblazers pick up two. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance for another one at the strike. How about that dish by Schroeder? Always a good idea to get it to the open man. That's, that's just good basketball. For Los Angeles, they have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. Definitely an area where they can improve. Only 73% as a team the from the line last Mind year. The yeah, a, as a group, really a dismal year for them from the line last season, guys. And Bryant, no good on that one. Trailblazers leading by three. Stolen by none. And there's the foul. It will go on Josh Hart. 
That's his third foul so far. Bonus situation in effect, so we'll head to the free throw line for two. Lakers shooting their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. First one falls for him. And so he makes both from the line. 15 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Schroeder against Simon. Over to the left wing. So at the end of one quarter of play, still a close game. Trailblazers lead by one. And don't go away. We'll be back with the action for the start of the second quarter in just a moment. some good action in the books as we get back to the game that's been pretty close here so far and from Portland guys what jumps out to you stat wise well one way to generate more offense pound the offensive glass that was the difference in the first oh there's no doubt about it guys without those second chance points this game would have had a much different feel to it Clark with the dramatic rise in three point shooting do you think the league will ever experiment with a four point shot I don't think so, Kevin. That's a bit gimmicky for me, but I'm somewhat old school and traditional. I think you could maybe test it out somewhere, maybe in the All-Star game or the G League. The league hasn't been shy about trying new things and seeing what works and what doesn't. They've got LeBron James, Kendrick Nunn out there with Russell Westbrook. Then it's Thomas Bryant, and it's Walker in at the small forward. That's the group for the Lakers to start the second quarter. Looking at Los Angeles, they took the win in their last game against the Clippers. Offensive rebound, Bryant lays it up off the glass. And the Lakers lead by one. Excellent activity and timing on the offensive glass. That's how you get extra possessions. And there's the pass to Winslow. Here's Nurkic. That one misses. Some solid defense from Bryant. James finds none. Inside. And Bryant slams it in. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. And with an update from the sideline, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thanks very much. Now, the Blazers missed the playoffs last season for the first time in almost a decade. Coach Billups says, it's been a lot here so far, but I just know that I'm built for this. This is what I do, and it gives me the opportunity to stand up as a man to show that I can lead. I'm ready for it. Kevin? I think he is. He's embracing the challenge, which is uh, fun to watch. David, thanks. Well, the ability to knife inside and convert Lillard is fearless when it comes to attacking the basket. Westbrook kicks to Walker. Back to Westbrook. LeBron outside. The kick out to Walker. Fires for three. Cranes the three-pointer. Walker's got the lead up to six now for Los Angeles. Just a little confusion among the D as to who was supposed to be on it. Miller against Westbrook. And here's Sharp. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. And the rejection by James. Nurkic can't hit. Los Angeles leading by six. Here's none. Here's Bryant. Beautiful dish, and the layup goes down. Bryant's got six points in the quarter. And what's your take, guys, on the hustle sticks for Los Angeles? Uh, how about the ferocity we have seen from them on defense? I mean, they're looking to contest every shot that goes up. And I don't think we can ignore the activity they've shown on the defensive end. Plenty of quick hands and 
It's resulted in a number of steals. The Lakers making a switch here. Beverly's checked in. And then for the Trailblazers, Jeremy Grant, he's checked in for Eubanks. And it's Peyton in for Sharp. Here's Lillard. A beautiful reverse layup. Lillard's got nine. No excuse giving Lillard that kind of positioning. That's just too easy. That was the 2K drive. As that move deserved another look. And the awareness of his footwork and body on that drive. Wow. Beverly with the ball. Now Peyton defending. Beverly the pass to LeBron. Shot clock at six. And that one's good. Westbrook. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. As one of the biggest stars in the NBA, Russell Westbrook Clark puts a lot of energy into his charity work. Yeah, he really does, and I don't know how many people really recognize that, but I know he's appreciated for it. He started the Why Not Foundation to help underserved communities, and they're doing some great work. Russ said, why not, has always been his attitude whenever he's pursuing a tough goal, and thus he named his foundation the same way. Westbrook. Left side, Bryant. Shoots over Nurkic. The shot by Bryant, no good. Trailblazers trail by seven. Winslow, the pass to Lillard. Stolen by Westbrook. Let's a floater go. And the layup good by Beverly. Beverly's got his second bucket. It really turned it around here in the second quarter after shooting less than 40% from the field in the first. Boy, that's a look. He has to finish, and he knows it. Lone opportunity. Outside Westbrook. Pass to Walker. Passes it to Beverly. A chance there to push it to double digits, but it's off the mark. Here's Grant. And it's LeBron James with the rebound. LeBron's got nine rebounds now tonight. Walker's shot is off. Trailblazers trail by nine. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need the basket. And Lillard kicks to Winslow. And there's the whistle. Illegal screen. And guys, point of emphasis for the league is to really crack down on illegal screens. Yeah, you know, he might have gotten away with that a few years ago, but not anymore. No way. Now you've got to be stationary on those screens. No extra hips or elbows or they'll call it. Davis has checked in for Bryant. Now here's Westbrook. They lead by their biggest margin of the game. Nine. Davis looking for an opening. And a wide open look for Walker. Good. And the assist goes to James. James has got his fourth assist in this one. His shooting has been outstanding. <laughs> Definitely one of the reasons they're up in this game. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. Hard to believe, Greg, last season, LeBron missing the playoffs for just the third time in his career. And Kevin, it, it almost felt surreal to not have him in the playoffs. I mean, this guy's been a fixture in the postseason for almost two decades now. Just another bullet on LeBron's incredible resume. Westbrook against Lillard. And he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. That one on Davis. And known for being a clutch performer, Dame has his sights set on title. A, a true leader with a winning mindset. And he makes the first. And you look at the loyalty Lillard has shown. Stuck with the Blazers through thick and thin. It's why he is beloved in Portland. He 
And both free throws good for Damian Lillard. And at some point, Greg, you wonder if Lillard is the greatest blazer of all time. Listen, he is in the conversation. You'd have to include Walden Drexler up there. But Lillard's resume in Portland has a strong argument. Now here's Davis. High post shot. And they'll get another chance. Up top, Walker. No good on the shot. A bit long that time. He has to make that one. I mean, you have to make the defense pay when they slough off of you like that. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when your teammate makes that kind of play. Yeah, you know, when you're looking to close the gap, you need guys who will take it upon themselves to step up, take the initiative, and make something happen. Now here is Davis. His last outing, he had 24 points. And Walker throws it down. The finish was nice, but the setup was better. Yeah, G.A., the pick working to full effect before the stuff. And, you know, not enough help from the defense there to compensate. He gets a clean look, and that's exactly how you draw it up. And the dunk by LeBron. And, man, can LeBron still get up at his age after all of those miles on his body in the NBA. Really impressive. Now here's Winslow. He's got six. Lillard from outside. Good and the nice assist from Winslow. Lillard's got 14 points for the game. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. And here's Walker. After Damian Lillard was able to get the three to go, Walker dishes to Davis. Wide open look. Here's LeBron, and the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. Well, the defensive rotations have been a step slow, and it's really helped them get that ball inside time after time. Well, I'd have to say Lillard is one of the game's best passers right now. Everly with the ball. Addition out to James. Pass to Walker. Now Beverly. And stolen by Lillard. And the rejection by James. Out of bounds, Trailblazers ball as Portland keeps possession. And Portland making a change here. Simons has checked in. Your catch against Davis. Just five to shoot to the left side wing. Nobody near Lillard. And it's Lillard again missing. And, you know, even though that shot didn't go down, I, I like how they got him a wide-open look in space there. He is single-handedly dropping the temperature in here with that cold streak. And he's got to find other ways to contribute then because his shot-making is not happening right now. Nice work to get it inside and draw the contact. Exactly. The defense determined not to allow the easy layup right there. They'll settle for making him earn the free throws. good on the free throw. So for the Trailblazers, Little comes in for Yusuf Nurkic. And it's Josh Hart in for Damian Lillard. Good on the second free throw. And it's Schroeder with the ball. He brings it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. They've held a 12-point lead earlier. Outside, Walker. Some nice passing here by Los Angeles. To the middle. The pass to Reeves. Down to five on the shot clock. 
And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Nasir Little picks one up. No, I tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Yeah, if you're going to foul, then make sure that you don't give a chance for the and one. It's his first trip to the line. And going back to his performance at the line last year, guys, 84% as a free throw shooter. Yeah, that's a great asset to have, guys, uh, for any team. Coming down the stretch in close games, you've got a guy who's confident and very good at the line. When he steps up there, you feel good about it. He misses the free throw. Kendrick Nunn, he's checked in for Los Angeles. And he sinks the second. Here's Simons. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. He takes it in. Davis with some nice D. Well, you know, stopping him is never easy to do, but the defense was strong there. Dishes it to Schroeder. Pass to Nunn. Back to Schroeder. Passes to Davis. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. Charts checked in for Peyton. Trailblazers trail by eight. Now here's Little. He's got five. And here's Sharp. Reeves with the rebound. Grant against Davis. Shoots over Grant. That one wide left. You know, guys, you can tell he wants to contribute more, but his teammates have picked up the slack for him. That's what being on the team is all about. Lakers leading by eight. Davis with it. Over Little. And the Lakers with another miss. Down low. It's tipped. And pushing it up. Here's Los Angeles. Davis has got the ball. Little with the rebound. And he's been way off the mark this quarter. It's been ugly. Here's Sharp. And Jones sends it back. And there's a whistle. It goes on Shaden Sharp. That's his first foul. Eubanks, he's checked in for the Trailblazers. Los Angeles has gotten half their shots from three-point range to go down in the second quarter. Three of six from downtown. Kicks it to Davis. Looking to end his cold spell. And it's Portland with the rebound. Sharp's got four rebounds in this game. Here's Hart. And Davis sends it back. Picked his pocket. Hart the pass to Simons. And Jones sends it back. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Jones. Portland with the ball. Still scoreless. You wonder if it's starting to get to him. No good on the quick three. None wide open. Misses the three. Trailblazers trail by eight. Here's Simons. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Greg, when you watch Anthony Simons play, you can see the burst he has on the ball. And that goes for him attacking the rim and rising up for a shot. Impossible to stay in front of him with that quick first step. And with his skill and athleticism, boy, the sky's the limit. And the first one at the line is good. And Simons drops them both. Here's Schroeder. He's still scoreless so far in this one. 
Pass to Nunn. Schroeder dishes to Jones. Loads it up for Davis. Very pretty alley ramp. You know, with that kind of height mismatch, you've got to send help defensively. And so here's Portland. Eight-point game. They'll host the Denver Nuggets after this one. That'll be the first of four played at home for them. Simons, the pass to Hart. There's 25 seconds left in the first half of the game. Just five on the clock. There's the pass to Sharp. Let's the three fly. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Davis has got six rebounds now in the game. Schroeder outside. Back to Davis. And the last second attempt doesn't fall. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers in the driver's seat, up eight points at the end of the quarter. And it's been their rugged defense setting the tone. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Russell, how confident are you that there's nobody that can stay in front of you? Uh, very confident. Uh, I have a lot of confidence in myself. Uh, I put a lot of work in in the summertime, but I'm very confident. That is never a problem for you, Russ. Thanks very much. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you, and stay with us, folks. We'll be back just after halftime to get the third quarter started. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey again, everybody. I'm Ernie Johnson. Shaq is here. Kenny's here. You're watching the NBA Halftime Show on 2K Sports. A competitive matchup for the Lakers in the first quarter. They stayed within arm's reach in that opening period. Five points, their largest deficit. They found a nice groove in the second quarter, running out to an eight-point lead. And taking a look at the Lakers, Shaq, what'd you think? Ball movement was a real factor for the new offense. They play themselves with the patience. The guys got shots in their favorite spots. When you get those high percentage looks, good things tend to happen. And the Kenny, what did you see from Portland? Whatever they're trying to do on offense, it ain't working. If they have any chance of coming back in this one, they're going to have to be more methodical in their approach. Talent without discipline will never result in sustained success. And that's all we have for now. Tell the folks goodbye, Shaq. Tell the folks goodbye, goodbye. Kenny. Goodbye. Go to Kevin Harlan. And if you're just joining us in this one, first half is in the books. One half to go. We're seeing a tremendous game from Damian Lillard. No problems fighting his way to the rim in this one. A lot of points in close. Yeah, you know what, guys? They gave him too many free runs to the hoop in the first half. I think they've got to be a lot tougher on him. Body him up. Be physical with him. We played through the first half. Plenty of basketball, though, left in this one. Trailblazers trail by eight. Here's who Chauncey Billups will start the second half with. Nurkic the pivot with Grant at the other post spot. Damian Lillard out there with Gary Payton the second. And it's Winslow in at the three side. Nurkic can hit. A slight advantage for them in the rebound department, but that oftentimes is all it takes. Especially when you're scoring the ball at a decent clip the way they have. I mean, they've done exactly what's necessary to take the lead. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Well, when you look at the assist totals, hey, they've been clearly the better team. Lillard, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Lillard's got 16 points. And there's an edge to Lillard's game. He, he's fearless, and you can see it when he's finishing in traffic. Everly with the ball. Now defended by Grant, and there's the call on Patrick Beverly. That'll be his second foul of the game. Walker's checked in for Jones. And so Grant will bring it up for the Trailblazers. Lillard looking around. To the wing on the left, and it's out of bounds. The Trailblazers able to retain possession here. And he made the right read on that play, but just couldn't secure the steal. You know, fellas, one second quicker, and that's going the other way. 
And that replay showed just how forceful that block was. And big defensive plays like that will help them stay in control of this one. And here in the second half of play, we're just over a minute in. Grant finds Winslow. Off target from three-point range. Lakers leading by eight. To the paint and stolen by Peyton. Alert against Westbrook. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. You know, Dane loves to test the defense like that. Runs up against it and then outworks them. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And 88 from the line a season ago. He was one of the best shooters in the league. You know, he really did excel at the stripe. I mean, they couldn't have asked for too much more from him when it came to knocking down free throws. The first free throw is good. Free throw is good from Lillard. Right around a minute and a half. Played here in the third quarter. Pass to Beverly. And here's Walker. Back to Beverly. Walker with it. Now defended by Grant. The Lakers have gone 7 of 9 from the free throw line tonight. First free throw is good. And so Walker nails both of them. Trailblazers trail by eight. Lillard outside. He kicks to Winslow. Six to shoot. Back to Lillard. Fires the three. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. James has got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. And, the, and they're controlling the boards, Kevin. That's plus five in that category. And guys, you know that rebounding is a huge part a huge component of winning games it's not a glamorous stat but it's necessary if you're going to be a winning team and Lillard kicks to Grant over LeBron and another shot and Lillard lays it up and in Lillard's got 20 points what strength from Lillard just not allowing the defense to have the last word pass to Walker Left side, Davis. Let's go. And another basket for the Lakers. So far, so good to begin this half. They're three for three. Perfect. Here's Lillard. 20 points for him. Nurkic trying to get open. Nice yet again. And the rejection by LeBron. And here's Walker outside. The shot, no good. Now Portland takes it the other way. Even with that miss, they're shooting 75% coming out of the break. That's a strong start to the half. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Thanks very much. The reviews have been good for the league's moves to eliminate foul calls on non-basketball moves. The NBA said it wanted the game to be played, not manipulated. Draymond Green says it helps to know that you'll have more of a fair opportunity as a defender. Guys can't just cheat the system. Kevin, back to you. That's great to see, David. Thank you. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. And, you know, I think he's going to tell them simply, we have to show more fight on the interior. That's the top priority right now. Now here's Lillard. Peyton passes to Lillard. 
Shot clock at five. No good from the wing. He had a couple in the first, but so far he's been unable to get uncorked here. Man, is it easy to remain in awe of the greatness of LeBron James Clark. This is a guy that just doesn't seem to age. It's amazing. Yeah, it's really one of the remarkable runs in the history of sports in my mind, quite honestly, Kevin, on and off the floor. We know he spends a lot of time and money to keep his body in peak shape. He yet is still not showing any real signs of slowing down. We know Father Time is undefeated, but I tell you what, LeBron is giving it a run for its money. Here's Beverly following the basket by Jeremy Grant. And Beverly kicks to James. From down in the low post, it goes. James has got eight. Everything going to plan here to start the third. 80% shooting thus far. Westbrook against Lillard. Pass to Winslow. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown so far for the Lakers. Well, you know, for me, the passing has been fantastic all night. Everybody loves watching this style of basketball where the ball moves and players move. Coaches, fans, and even us broadcasters can appreciate that kind of action. And one other thing they have done well has been scoring and transition, looking to run whenever they can. He's off on the first. And he's good on the second. So here's Westbrook. Ten points for him. Outside, Walker. Now Beverly. Back to Walker. Ball's knocked loose. Stolen by Grant. Winslow against James. Another shot. Nurkic can't hit. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. They have a nine-point lead. So here's Westbrook. Top of the key, Bryant. Four on the shot clock. Here's Beverly. Nurkic with the block. And that 7-2 wingspan for Nurkic, he can just gobble up shots. He knocks that one away with authority. Trailblazers trail by nine. Peyton drives in. It's hauled in by Beverly. Beverly's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. And it's Gary Payton the second with the foul. That's foul number two for him. And with the play-in tournament, single game elimination comes to the NBA, Clark. It brings tremendous ratings in the college game. And it's good to see it, I think, here in the pros. I agree with you 100%, Kevin. Absolutely. I mean, the midseason tournament might also have that same kind of appeal. I think those high stakes really make for compelling, dramatic viewing. Defensively, you just can't afford to give these easy looks up. Just asking to get burned if you do. Now, here's Beverly. Outside Westbrook. The pass to Walker. And Ronnie Walker picks up the foul. And that'll be his third foul so far. The second half has it gone nearly as well for him. He'd only had one before the break in terms of turnovers, but that number's grown as this game progresses. The Lakers making a switch here. Schroeder's checked in. And a switch here also for Portland. Simons, he's checked in for Winslow. Outside, Walker. Pass to Beverly. There's the triple. And they recover it. And stolen by Payton. Lillard, the pass to Grant. Doesn't go that time. And gotta like what they've been doing down low in the post. I certainly do. You know I like to see guys do their work inside. Their rebounding has been excellent, and that's always important in a close game. 
Catching up on the changes for Los Angeles. Reeves is checked in. And it's Kendrick Nunn in for Patrick Beverly. An almost entirely new group here for Portland. Little, he's checked in for Yusuf Nurkic. Eubanks comes in for Grant. Sharps checked in for Peyton. And Hart subbed in for Lillard. Here's Reeves. Schroeder outside to stop the drought. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. And when you think about veteran guard Dennis Schroeder, still such a shifty, unpredictable player. Yeah, he really is because of the way he can change gears and play at different speeds. Very impressive. At his best, when he's putting blinding speed to use, he doesn't always unleash it, but when he does, it's very effective. That's good from Schroeder. Boy, the shifty, quick-footed Schroeder is a um, great weapon to have. Whether he's starting or coming off the bench, he's a very effective player. Jones checked in for Los Angeles. Schroeder hits them both. Impeccable from the line since halftime. No misses yet. You can't do much better than that, guys. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. And no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Well, I like the way he capped off that drive. The one-hand hole punch. There's Schroeder. The Blazers getting the bucket. It's stolen by Little. Passes it to Eubanks. Over Jones. Eubanks, no good. Los Angeles leading by five. Here's Schroeder. Makes it off the glass. Schroeder's ability to accelerate in the open floor. One of his primary advantages as a player. And here is Simon. Pass to Hart. Out to the right wing. Six on the shot clock. Shoots the three. Rebounded by the Lakers. Bryant's got six rebounds now in the game. And uh, he's just had one attempt at the line early. A free throw drops for Bryant. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Grant's checked in. Free throw is good from Bryant. Portland with the ball. Simon's on the wing. He's guarded by Schroeder. The feed to Grant. Fades back. And it's sent back by Bryant. He's been ice cold tonight. And, you know, you look at the scoreboard guys, they really could have used this contribution. Simons against Schroeder. Five on the clock. From the baseline. Up again. Great positioning on the putback. And the Lakers lead by 11. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the boards has been impressive. Guys, that's putting it mildly. I mean, they've been absolutely dominant. Now, here's Sean. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. A guy who hasn't played a lot of ball. Sharp, though, has all the all-star tools they think available to him. An exceptional shot maker from outside. And he's got great vertical bounce, almost a seven-foot wingspan. And he is relentless in his attack.
The free throw drops for Sharp. And he makes both free throws. And so it's Schroeder with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. Nine-point game. Now the pass to Bryant. Shot from the wing. And the jumper falls for him. Bryant's got six here in this quarter. And even with the big lead, he remains focused on the task at hand. Yeah, and you know, that is some shaky and shoddy defensive work. They've got to tighten it up. Sharp the pass to Little. Nice D from Bryant. Los Angeles leading by 11. Inside, none. And he makes it look easy, dunking it hard with one hand. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun right now. Yeah, offensively, they've just been rolling. Impossible to stop. Sharp. Reeves with the rebound. For Los Angeles, they've gone 8 of 13 on shot attempts to begin the second half. And it's Schroeder missing. Yeah, I tell you what, for him, this has been a game to forget. But somehow they still find themselves with the lead. Grant, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Emphatically thrown down by Mr. Grant. Nicely done. Pass to Reeves. Now, none. And yes, it's good. Nunn's got the lead up to 13 now for the Lakers. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. Yeah, and they're really getting pummeled on points in the paint here. Boy, at the offensive end, his game is so impressive. I mean, he's a threat every time up the floor. We've got 123 left here in the third quarter. Passes it to Nunn. Back to Schroeder. Jones against Grant. Here's Reeves. The kick out to Bryant. Clock at four. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Boy, the defense got lucky there with him missing it. But they don't want to chance that again. Hart, no good. And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. And you know what? He's not going to give up an easy finish at the rim. I mean, that's just uh, against his constitution. This is his first free throw of the game. And really, the line a season ago was just a battle for him. Just about a 72% free throw shooter. And he knocks down the first one. And the Lakers making a change here. Davis is checked in. And the Trailblazers making a change here as well. Payton's checked in. And he can't hit the second. Trailblazers trail by 12. To the inside. It's stolen by Bryant. And now, here's Davis, the fast break opportunity. Reeves can't hit. Portland's gotten off to a very slow start from three-point range in the second half. They're 0 for 4. Grant, that's good. And I tell you, I love watching Grant get busy down there. I mean, his impressive leaping ability and his quick release on the shot allow him to score at a high rate down low. Here's Schroeder. Following the basket by Jeremy Grant, it's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Here's Reeves. Jones, the pass to Bryant. Cross contact on the shot, and now a three-point play chance as he'll head to the line. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Boy, the defense looks shell-shocked. I mean, they're on the ropes right now, on their heels.
There's 10 seconds left in the third. Here's Simon. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. It's on Dennis Schroeder. On the night, he's gone two for two at the strike. Terrific form at the line throughout last season. 89% on the year. Yeah, those were fine numbers he posted um, at the line. It was hard to find fault with anything he did from the strike. First free throw is good. And Simons drops them both. Bryant, he's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for the Los Angeles Lakers. Scoring, rebounding, he was all over the place during that quarter. They are riding his performance right now. Right back after this break. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. And, and I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Yeah, and with the accuracy to go along with that vision. I mean, he put the ball in the absolute perfect spot. That's how you orchestrate it. And there may not be a lot of drama down the stretch as we head into the fourth quarter, but stranger things have happened. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Patrick Beverly out there with Russell Westbrook. And it's Walker in at the three, the small forward. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. And now here's Nurkic. He'll bring it up for the Trailblazers. It's deflected. How impressive was that? The little fella, Beverly, extending out for the block. Showed us some nice timing for a guy that's not much taller than 6'2". Los Angeles leading by 11. To the middle. Here's LeBron. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. Ten points for LeBron. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on. To the inside. Grant. There's another block. A, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. Now here's Beverly following the miss by Jeremy Grant. It's Beverly on the wing on the money from 12 feet away. And the Lakers lead by 15. And you see the ability to rise and fire from mid-range even against that length. You know, guys, if they're inside, that shot probably gets blocked. But from mid-range, I mean, he's able to get it off over the bigger defender there. Yeah, clearly he had an established position there. Yeah, and, and I, I like this call because you want the refs in that situation. If there's any doubt, err on the side of giving the benefit of the doubt to the offensive player. That should have been a block, and it was. Now here's Walker. Westbrook kicks to Beverly. Lock at six. Here's James. And Winslow pulls it down. Winslow's got six rebounds in the game. And Damian Lillard with the jam. And for a point guard, Lillard has some hops. Outstanding at knowing when to use them for the dunk. Los Angeles leading by 13. Outside Westbrook. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. Bounce pass from Beverly. Six to shoot. Pass to Westbrook. Three-pointer on the way. And it's sent back by Lillard. There's Winslow. He feeds it to Grant. And the dunk by Grant. Yeah, on his menu, dunking is one of the specialties. A fantastic jammer who really wrecks that rim. 
for Los Angeles. They've gone two for five on field goal attempts in the fourth quarter. Westbrook against Lillard. Westbrook can't get it to go. Trailblazers trail by 11. Peyton with the ball. Grant at the elbow. Just five on the clock. And he trims the lead to single digits. 11 points for Justice Winslow. And that assist got him a little nod from his teammate after that. Third minute of action now gone here in the fourth. Outside Westbrook. Walker taking his time here. LeBron passes to Westbrook. LeBron trying to free himself up. And Westbrook gets it to go on the assist by James. Just by nature of his style, Westbrook is going to draw contact. So he's got to be strong enough and focused enough to play through it. And he is and does. Oh, what an impressive triple drive. That replay brought to you by Mobile One. He's doing everything he can to put this game to bed. And great score there to help his team. Oh! <laughs> is Dane trying to get in the dunk contest? Looked like it on that incredible finish. And one more look at that fantastic Mobile One drive. And you can just sense his determination, trying to do everything he can to keep this game within reach. And it's out of bounds. Uh, they say it was last touched by Grant. Grant against LeBron. I like watching Grant work hard on the defensive end. He puts great effort into that end of the floor. He's good at pestering whoever he happens to be on, and his long reach helps him do that. Well, uh, they're getting stops, and they're attacking on the offensive end. And, you know, it's taken a big run, but they were able to get back into this one. Very impressive. No quitting these guys. So it's the Lakers now. Portland making their last shot. Loads it up for Davis, and it's Davis with the jam. You know, when you're open on Westbrook's team, you make sure to find him. He's a selfless distributor. Now Lillard. The pass to Winslow. Grant against LeBron. Shot clock at six. Lillard misses. And, and they continue to control the glass. Guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team, and that's why they're ahead. Now, here's Beverly inside, and stolen by Peyton. It's stolen by Davis. Hands the shot with nobody near him. And it's an 11-point Laker lead. Hey, how many bigs do you know that can pull up like that and knock down the jumper? I could probably count them on two hands. Now, here's Westbrook. Pass to Beverly from deep. Nailed from three-point land. They didn't get a chance to knock one down in the first. But the defense left him a look, and he nailed it. He'll make them pay when he's open. Lillard against Westbrook. Lillard outside. Outside, Baton. To end the run. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Davis has got his second rebound here tonight. Ron right side. That's in there. Davis with the assist. And 12 points for LeBron. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. And don't leave out the coaching staff here now. I mean, their game plan has been perfect. Outside Westbrook. Lakers working the ball around now. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And with the struggles AD has had to stay healthy, and you wonder, though, if the team's going to focus on having him be at his best for that postseason run and try to manage the wear and tear. No good at the stripe this time. Second miss is also. And when Davis is on the floor, Greg, he is a force. But how do you keep him healthy into the playoffs? That is the question. I mean, sustaining his output over a full season isn't easy. But Davis has had 
a bit of bad luck with the injury. So you have to mitigate ways to keep him available. Now here's Westbrook after the miss from Damian Lillard. Deep two from Beverly. And there's the call on James. That is his first foul of the game. Trailblazers trail by 16. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. The edge on the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. And really a reflection of their superior effort level to this point. It seems to me they've gone after this win a little bit more. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. Of course, he didn't have an attempt there in the first half. He's hoping to be a little bit more active and aggressive here and draw some fouls here in the second. Now here's Lillard. Passes it to Winslow. Payton in the corner. Off the mark and the drop continues. No other way to put it. Just a rough quarter in terms of scoring. He has not been helping at all. They get it back. Davis grabs the rebound again. This kind of effort is amazing. And he will not be denied. And again, it's the Trailblazers missing. And here's James outside. Rebound by Norkic. Norkic has got rebound number 10 tonight with that last one. Heaton inside. Guarded by Walker. No good from Peyton. Their game plan needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because he is just not there offensively. Simons, he's checked in for Damian Lillard. Here are the Lakers with the ball. They're on a 13-4 run right now. Westbrook surveying the D. And Beverly kicks to Westbrook. And a wide-open look for James. And that one is off. So the Trailblazers will take it the other way. There's Winslow. And the layup's good off the glass. He's been a different guy here in the second half. His shooting percentage far better than it was before the break. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. Outside Westbrook. Pass to Walker. Your catch against Davis. The pass to Walker. James in the post. And it's Davis with the jam. There's no stopping that. AD is too long and strong to bother that alley-oop. Here's Simon. Oh, oh. He is a highlight reel unto himself, guys. Uh, that could be a contender for the dunk of the year, I think. Without question, a crowd pleaser to the 10th degree. Here's Westbrook. The Blazers getting the bucket. And here's Beverly. Back to Westbrook. I'm deep. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Grant's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. And they've controlled the boards, and that's a big reason why they're controlling the lead. Yeah, they've brought the sandpaper edge to their attack, really fighting and scrapping inside. A lot of grit and grind with these guys. Beverly for three. Rebound by Norkic. Norkic has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Here's Grant. It's hauled in by Beverly. And here's the Lakers. They're on a 13-4 run. Here's Davis and finished off by Davis. When Davis gets going like this, there's no way you can stop him, giving you his entire package right now. Simons, the pass to Winslow. Peyton against Beverly. Peyton dishes to Winslow. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. No good on that one. He hits the second from the line. A disappointing trip to the line there. Even though it was just one miss, now is not the time to be missing those. 
Now, here's Westbrook. Pass to Beverly. 143 left in the fourth quarter. And he banks in the layup. Beverly's got seven points here in this quarter. Late in the game, up big, they continue to attack. Yeah, I don't think you want to get loose and sloppy or ease up, but it is time for them to start using that clock a bit. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. They're behind by 19. 137 left to play in the final quarter. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Damian Lillard. And I love that it's been a hard-charging performance. Jump shots have been kind of an afterthought. His main goal has been to attack the rim and put the D in some tough spots and also finishing strong. 137 left in the game. There's Winslow. Peyton with it. He's picked up by James. And Davis sends it back. And the NBA last season announced the creation of six new trophies for the division winners and named them after six pioneering players. Kevin, anytime you can connect the past, the legacy of the league to the present in meaningful ways, I think that's a winning situation. I mean, greats like Wayne Embry, Sam Jones, Willis Reed, who paved the way for generations of black players. I mean, I think it's a great move to recognize them and continue to realize the importance they played in helping to build the foundation on which the league stands now. Coming out here tonight and making a statement. Really good work all around for Los Angeles. Starting five must have been happy to get so much help from the reserves in this game. And they not only lightened the load, the subs did nothing less than guarantee a win. And ever win important. And this one will go down as win number three. And asserting themselves up front here, guys. They'll be taking the front end of a four-game season series between these two. They, they've got to feel good about getting the upper hand tonight against Portland. And something we've come to almost expect is greatness from this guy. Such an overall great performance it was for LeBron. He did all the dirty work that they needed, clearing out space underneath and securing rebounds. Here's LeBron, and he lays it straight in. And it's just competing. You know, giving your best when it matters most. Yeah, you know, once they got victory in their view, a huge injection of energy and a great run to finish it off. So it's Los Angeles winning this one easy. It was a tale of two teams tonight, one that was in total control, operating flawlessly, and the other just searching for answers that they could never find. I mean, the energy here is just so tremendous. Fans involved from the get-go, and once they started to really pour it on, it was fun to see that rhythm and flow from their perspective. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks, guys. Russell, congrats. How satisfying is this win? It's great. Um, you know, I think we supposed to do. We came in and competed at a high level defensively for the most part in uh, the other game. And you continue to keep it rolling, Russ. Thanks very much. Back to you guys. All right, David, thank you. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for being with us. See you next time.